Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, it's Luke here, and uh, today, so let's see, you're stuck and getting over it. Well, I have beaten this game multiple times, so if you need help with beating the game and default map, I can show you. So, first things for here, I'm gonna make sure I'm recording. Sorry, all right, we're recording so. First things first, what we're gonna do. So we start off in the game, and uh, I'm gonna go with the default. All right, so, okay, for this tree. Okay, so, of course we climb forward now. And then for this tree, what we're gonna wanna do we're gonna jump as high as we can and then grab this part of the tree. Then we're just gonna gently set ourselves right here and spring upward. Just keep on going upward and make sure you're moving to the position right. And um, just make sure you keep moving right. Okay, now we've landed on the tip, so what we're gonna do is just jump up off the tree. Just, the tree might take some practice, but whatever the hell you need to do, just get over that fucking tree. Okay, so now for this mountain, we can just we can just grab this and then grab this. Okay, okay. And with that stick peeping out of it, what we're going to want to do is here, first let's get up there. What we're going to want to do is we're going to want to Put our sledgehammer right in between those twigs and then swing ourselves up over the top of that rock and here we are. Now when you're down here, you're going to want to jump and grab this small rock right here. And then fling yourself up and if you can reach your hammer and just swing up on the paddle. And now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to Bring yourself up and then gently set yourself down on this dead tree right here. And then just spring upward, grab the shed. And then now you just gotta get yourself up here. And this is um, a bigger jump coming up right here. So right here, there, yes, there's a bigger jump coming. I'm gonna jump so you get, or actually I'm gonna zoom out so you guys can see it. See, we, what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna jump up to those barrels like I'm doing right here. I just got thrown down. So, the tutorial for this part is we're gonna wanna jump and throw ourselves up. It's gonna be kinda tricky. See, that's what we're gonna, this is what we're gonna be wanting to do. But, I'm gonna do that with not with the zoom out mod setting though. Shit. Okay, glitchless. Now, um, hold up. Now, glitchless, okay. And now, what we're gonna wanna do for there, I gotta actually show the tutorial for it, so, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set ourselves on the front windshield of the van and we're gonna jump, grab this pipe, sewage pipe, and then fling ourselves up. And then we're gonna wanna grab this right here, the tip of the rock. And then we bring ourselves and then set your pot or ass or whatever up onto the top of the barrel and then come up here and then grab this. And right here, we're gonna have to knock the bucket off, or the cup off. Then we're gonna have to grab this and <coughs> swing up. And then grab this rock, then <coughs> grab this rock. And you can go to the garbage cans if you want. There's nothing to do there, though. There's just a um, small mouse Easter egg. Let's, uh, let's zoom in and see if we can find that. See if we can find the mouse. See, if you could see it, you probably can't, you might not be able to see it. There is a mouse where I'm clicking right now. 
Let's reset their camera distance. Okay, now we're gonna wanna climb up. And um, and if you can get to right here, it's totally okay if you don't, but if you can get to right here, jump up and then grab the edge of the red part. If you can, it's really slippery, so it might be pretty fucking hard, but so it, it might take a few tries, but once you have it done, once you get it good, then you have it done. So, but if you can't make it to up to the rock, then what you're gonna want to do is jump from here and try to climb yourself up onto it. And you can use the use this rock or just do this for this part right here. You can do that if you want, but here I'm gonna show you the other way. Let's bring ourselves back up to it. Back to the guide. And you can either do the way I just did or you can just grab, use this rock. The rock might be easier for beginners right there. Oh, and by the way, if you fall off this here, I'm gonna purposely fall off. We're gonna see, like, Okay, so if you're on the edge of this, and then, here, so let me turn around. So if you're on the edge of this and then you end up falling down, then you're gonna try to grab the small white rock peeping out of it like this. And then you bring yourself up here. This is a challenge, this could be a challenging part to some. First I'm gonna get it done, then I'm gonna show you how to do it. So let's bring ourselves up. Damn, this is so fucking hard. Uh, see if we can just bring ourselves up. Alright, so that is how I did it, but now I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Now... What you can do is you can bring yourself up onto this porta potty type thing. It's sort of like electrical or so, I don't know. Hopefully you don't have like electrical piss or shit or something like that. So we shed ourselves on top of it. And we're going to want to jump and then grab this metal thing. You'll hear a little clink. Bring yourself up, then you're going to grab the edge of that. Then you're going to grab this here. And then you're gonna, you can actually grab the rail to the balcony. It's super easy. See, you can just set yourself down on it. You won't even go onto the balcony. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna hit this, bring yourself up onto the ladder. Here, let's practice that a few times. There's a sink right there, by the way. Okay, so we go like this. This is what you do. You just keep watching me do it. And eventually you'll get good at it yourself. Like that. Oh, like that. Alright, now when you're up here, you're gonna go left and right. Swing your hammer left and right. Left and right. Left and right. Left and right. And you could either... You can either do like I'm trying to do to get yourself up here like this. You can either do it like that, or... That's a bathtub, by the way. Or you can just climb through here. And then go up across the hot tub, you know, do all this shit. Now, don't be nervous to fall right here. If you fall right here, then you'll just land. Then you'll just land here. But let's see what happens if we fall off this. So this is what happens if you fall off this. You'll get sent back to the bottom. And we don't want to get sent back to the bottom, so let's head on. So let's head back up. Now I'm going to try to help you see that doesn't happen. It might happen. You know, I was really shit at this game my first time, so we're gonna jump and then, okay, okay. So when you're at the edge of this grill, you're gonna jump over that gap. And you're gonna jump. Now this part can be hard to some. You're gonna use this umbrella, jump up and then grab the rake. And then just use the slide, of course. And then, when you're on this water, when you're on this beach ball, whatever, you jump over here onto these boxes. 
And then you basically own it. Oh wait, hold up, hold up. So I forgot to point out what we're gonna have to do right here. Now, oh, shit. what you're gonna wanna do, you're gonna wanna set yourself here. This part can be hard to begin to see. I was, it was really hard for me my first time. You're gonna swing over and then grab the boxes as fast as you can. It looks like we got stuck right here, which is fine. We can just shake ourselves out of that. Okay. And then, or, so there's either this way you do it, or there's another way you do it. There, you can do it the way I showed you, or you can do it this way, so. Let's head on back to the ladder. Oh, fuck. So, when you're on the ladder, let's head, oh, okay. So let's head to the ladder. All right, so when you're on the ladder, you just do the normal ladder type. You go this way. And then see if you can just get yourself over the bathtub and on like this, kind of. You're gonna wanna swing up and see if you can just catch that. If you can't do it, then do the slide way that I showed you. Then you grab the security camera. All right, so I gotta, of course I gotta point that out. I can just do it right in your fucking faces. So. Set your ass kind of on the tip of this chair, kind of. And then what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna jump diagonally, grabbing this secured camera. And then, yeah, yeah, it might take a few tries, but it's okay. Just shoot on up to this couch here thing. Then place yourself and jump up and we're gonna, Try to grab the red couch. I looks like I missed it, but then you just go, you know what, sorry, I'm already getting it done. I shouldn't be doing that. I'm gonna go back. Okay, you know what? Let's start from the toilet area. We just jump up here. That simple. But now on this part, if you do happen to fall between this area you will go here. I'm not sure if there is an actual way out of that space, but let's just see if there is. I'm not sure though, because I'm not a beginner at this game. I've played it a few times, so I'm pretty decent, but I don't, I still don't know how to, I've seen speedrunners get out of this part, but I don't know how to get out of that part. So if you fall down there, then you're just gonna wanna plop yourself right here. Uh, there's a key right there. And then, bam, bam. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> so, yeah, you can just like redo this part. We're not gonna do that though. We're just gonna get straight right back to the tutorial here. So. Before we fell through, what we were trying to do was come over here. Hold up. What we were trying to do. Wait, what? Just play music? Okay, good. Um, so. I'm gonna jump over here like this. An orange is there sweet, juicy fruit locked inside a bitter peel. That's not how I feel about a challenge. I only want the bitterness. It's coffee, it's grapefruit, it's licorice. Now, you're gonna wanna make sure you knock the orange off before climbing up the rocks. So here, right here. Knock the orange off the table. Now there are two ways to get this done. You could either do as I'm doing right now, where you grab it with the tip of your sledgehammer and then swing upward like this, but you might fall down like I just did. No worries. Now you're gonna wanna, oh shit, what just happened? Oh 
Okay, you know, I think we reset it by accident. Mm. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay, here we go, here we go. I accidentally reset the timer, it's fine. So then we're gonna wanna swing up. See if you can just, just practice doing that for a, damn it, mm. damn it. Mm. And there's the bottom of the map. So we're gonna go back upward. So yeah, let's practice doing that a few times. Here we go. Swing up, grab the granite rocks. Swing up, grab the granite rocks. Just keep practicing doing this strategy. Because there is another way to do it if you think this way is too hard. You know what, we missed that one. You know, you're gonna, there's gonna be a lot of falling. Like there was a lot of falling for me my first time. And even right now too, I'm just I'm just having to bring myself up just to show you guys how to do this. Like that. Let's practice one more time. Let's see if we can practice one more time. Oh. And damn it. Fuck oh, dude. Okay, here we go. Swing. Bro. Seriously? Bro. Okay, last practice. It's the third time, you know, or fourth time actually. It might not be very. Fifth time. Fifth time. Okay, so we can also we can just bring ourselves up right here. But there's also another way to get that part done. If you don't want to swing up, which you don't have to, you just pogo up like that. Pogo up and then you start climbing. Let's just practice. Let's just do that one more time as practice. Now, jump up, grab this, grab this, grab this. Just keep on grabbing those granite rocks, like, just like how I showed you, like, the grab this, grab this, like, grab this. You know, it doesn't seem like much, but I was just, that's just like, you just gotta watch that part that I just did. You can replay the video. This isn't a live stream, it's just a tutorial, so. And I just fell down again. You know, it's just gonna happen a lot to you. I know, it's frustrating. Very fucking frustrating. Now, there are really two ways you can do this, but that's not the way I... But the second way is like going like as slow as you can, like possibly. I don't really like doing that way though. What I like to do is just jump up and get it all done. So let's hop up here. I just like to head on up. If we can just get up there. Get up, stand up. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, this part's gonna be really damn hard. We're just gonna wanna sit here and jump up and then grab this. And then there is the gargoyle head. It looks like a cheetah head, but it has, it really has like a gargoyle body. All right, now what might happen is you might fall. And if you fall from this part, you're gonna fall, pause, assumably far down, you know? A lot of the times you think, all right, all right, we just have to, we just have to grab it. Here, hold up. You might think, okay, we're just gonna have to grab it and then go as fast as we can, but that doesn't work. That just sends you back, see? But that's not what you, cause that's not what you do though. You have to either jump up or go really slowly. But another thing that might happen is You might get sent over the car and all the way down back to the tree. See, here's the tree. You might get sent all the way back down to here. That's what, hap what was happening to me. And if you fall in the water, you'll just go back to the beginning of the game, no big deal. So, you're just gonna, I'm just gonna say, I'm just saying look out cause that stuff might happen to you guys. And um, back to the gargoyle head. 
Okay. So it's, it's an Easter egg. It's actually a gargoyle and it looks like just a cheetah. Fuck. Okay, now we're on the edge. Now we're gonna jump up and then grab his, grab his head. Jump up, grab the thumb. Now you think that's like a thumbs up. Yeah, forward progress, thumbs up, keep going. It's actually the middle finger sticking out. He's saying fuck you. I don't know why you would do that in a church, but I, I don't know. I'm just gonna grab here, climb. The backs are gonna try to scare us. Now, we grab this window and then swing up and try to get over the top. If you don't, then it's fine. It's just you just have to try to because if you don't, you might fall, but probably not. So then you get over this big rock and then use the bushes as a landing pad to jump and then swing your way up this house. Just take your way through the house and then up these rocks. Now this part here is the hard part because there is a fucking hat sitting there. It fell off a snowman. That's why it's there. It's an upside down snowman, by the way. Now you jump up, but then when you grab it, you're going to slide down a lot. See, I'm going to show you again how you slide down like that. Slide down, see? Now I'm going to show you the reason you all are sliding down. It's because you're supposed to jump. So you're supposed to jump and then grab, like, the top. Like above the small slippery spot you're supposed to grab above that right see it's even even i'm bad at this part and i've been playing this game for years so jump jump grab <coughs> Jump. Missed. You're gonna wanna jump. And you're supposed to grab, like, our goal is to get the hat out of our fucking way. Now we're gonna supposed to grab like the top of this there's a diagonal end right here. Here I'm gonna put my cursor on. I'm gonna see if I can put my cursor on it. Take my mouse cursor on. That is the diag if you can see that circle right there. I circled the diagonal part right there. We're supposed to get up to the flat snowy part. And then we have to get rid of this hat. And that in this, the reason it's here is because it fell off this snowman's head. See, see, it fell off his head down here. And we, oh damn, we knocked it far off, didn't we? Okay. Now we're gonna go back. We're gonna go glitchless. Now. Go to the edge of the anvil and jump. Now, we're gonna try not to fall into the pit. So, first I'm gonna show you how to jump up, like up there from the anvil. Okay, so. So we're gonna try to
Alright, so that's what we're trying to do is to get ourselves up to this ice rock. But that's not actually, that's not the tutorial part. The tutorial part is that you're gonna fall off this part a lot. See, even I'm trying to get it, but I can't. But if you fall down from the anvil, like, see, let's, let's go right here. If you fall off, then you'll just land, you'll just land here. Nothing, nothing to, to worry about. You just land there and you just gotta climb back. So, you can either use the anvil can either use it to jump up to the cliff like this. I am struggling if you haven't noticed. Now, I'm gonna go back down to show you another way to do it. Now, the anvil is probably the easy and the most common way to do it. But. But another way you can do it is you can use this cliff right here. You have to be pretty good at the game to do that part. To do it like that though. And you're gonna wanna climb through these ice rocks like this. Shit. So uh, oh fuck. Mm. Fuck. See so we're gonna we're trying to get to the ice rocks, that's what we're trying to do. Now what we're gonna wanna do is just we're gonna wanna climb over and then we're gonna reach the snowman's ass. We're gonna reach the snowman's ass. And then we're gonna go to the snowman's ass for just kind of a drop it down, so it might be kind of hard to reach. So then we're gonna go over here, and bam, just keep jumping across the rocks. If you fall down, I'll show what happens if you fall down. That's just right there though. Here, hold up. There are different spots you will fall down to. Let's show where you will fall down to here. For here, you will fall all the way back down to this rock, which is frustrating. Fuck! And then, yeah. So let's head back up. That's not gonna happen, that was just on purpose, just to, to be funny. So, up to the ice rock. And there's a small ledge. You can either grab it or just land there. Then comes the bucket. And do not ride the snake. By the way, do you listen to it and don't ride it. Now we've completed the bucket part, but I'm just gonna show you how to do it after showing you what happens if you do, however, ride the snake. This is what happens if you do ride the snake. I wonder where it takes us. Uh, takes you back to the very bottom of the mountain. And the, they're actually behind the mountain. This is a tree here too. Now, now we're not gonna climb all the way back up. We're just gonna take the easy way up. Like, don't think I'm cheating. This is just a tutorial. There's a snake right there. See if we were to press escape right here. He, lo he looks like he's about to kiss his hammer. All right, so for the bucket, I don't know if I'm gonna pass it first try. We're gonna wanna grab it. We're gonna wanna, it's really hard. We're gonna wanna, it's probably one of the most hard parts there is here. 
We're gonna grab it and then swing ourselves upward. Mm. We're gonna grab it and swing ourselves mm. up. It's and you can swing like the bucket a little bit back and forth. Swing back and forth, that's a good way to do it. I mean, just reach your, swing yourself up and then you're gonna gra wanna grab this and then land diagonally. So you're gonna jump right, we're gonna keep going right now. I think the rest of the game, we just go right now. So for the ice mountains here, I'm going to show you me doing the ice mountains, however. Okay, I did one of the ice mountains, here's the other one. But I'm gonna go back down to the bottom of them. Just to show you how. So, okay. A trick to the ice mountains, you may not notice, but there are actually secret hidden holes in the mountains. We're gonna wanna look for them. There, I found one. Swing up, we're gonna wanna look for another one. Swing up. And once we find the other one. Or you can just keep searching like, or you can just like go as fast as you can like I'm doing, but now you find the holes on the snowy mountain. The snowy mountain's easier because the whole thing's basically, the whole thing is basically just like snow and shit. You can just dig your hammer right into that snow. Then you're gonna wanna pull yourself up, hop over, just hop over the shopping cart. Once you're over the shopping cart, you're basically safe. Now, make sure you land here. We're gonna go high jump up onto this city hall type building. Then we're gonna wanna jump up here and then just climb the tower. So yeah, this is close to the, we're close to the end now. We just want to climb the tower. And bam! Then we float away. Goodbye, world. Time for outer space. And then we're gonna want to bring ourselves I up these rocks. I dedicate this game to you, the one who came this far. I give it to you with all my love. Then the end credits will rule. Feeling bad, 
I'm going down this road feeling bad And I ain't gonna be treated this way way Alright, so we have just beaten the game. That is how to beat the game. Thank you all for watching. But it says, welcome to the top of the mountain. If you're alone, you can come inside and say hello. But in order to say yes, we have to click this. It says, I solemnly swear that I'm not recording or streaming this. And I understand that only those who have climbed are welcome. But yes, it's blocked unless we solemnly slip where. But I am, reco I am recording, so... No, I'm not going to. And it turns out I've been up this mountain seven times by now. And no, I don't swear because I am recording. Now, I'm going to give you a guide. This is how you mute. If you don't like the music that's do, 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 or going down the road, you can just like turn off the music. Subtitles, turn. you can turn them off, turn down the voiceover volume, you can do it all. You change the sensitivity. I'm just gonna show you in this game. You can choose the quality too. So, there's a tree, we can go. We can go worst, which this is worst quality. I guess it's not very good. Then there's bad. Which isn't quite as bad. I mean, man, you know, the quality's not very good. And there's mediocre. It's just mediocre. Then there's good. Which is this. There's gray, which is the original. And then there's extreme. Which is, if you're like a pro gamer and you like it extreme, you can have extreme on like this. But I always keep it at gray. Because... Uh, that's how it originally was set at. That's what it was originally set at, so I keep it great. Mouse sensitivity doesn't really matter. Well, I guess it does matter, but if you have a fully, you move your mouse a little bit and he'll move it, he'll move his hand, sledgehammer so fucking much. But no sensitivity. It's like driving a tank. You have to you move your mouse across the road, but even worse than that, though. See? There's like no sensitivity. There's no sensitivity. So I keep it like in the middle. I was basically midsection, like how it started out with. Once you change the mass sensitivity, I don't think there's a way to like reset it, but it's fine. You can just, because so many people change the sensitivity, it helps them a little bit. Now those, that's my guide to the getting over its settings. Um, what does apply? Oh wait, shit, we gotta quit and redo. Yeah, I don't want to apply the settings. You might want to change the sensitivity later on. So if you hit apply, that I'll just keep the same thing for the whole game, which you probably won't want. Now it's time to show you the whole map that we just did. Um, let's see here. What we're going to do is we're going to go... Reset that camera distance. We're gonna zoom all the way out just to show you. Now, this is the whole map. You can see me at the very bottom climbing. Just look at the very bottom of the fucking map. You can just see me climbing. But it's really hard to climb over the tree when I look that small. See? Now, this is the whole map that we have done, ladies and gentlemen. It's pretty damn big, huh? Now, after showing you the map, I'm going to show you there's an Easter egg, so just watch till the end because I want you guys to see 
me unlock a secret. You could skip to the end too if you want, because I'm just gonna show you like the whole map. Just look around, you know. There's the full map, which is really damn big. It's fully zoomed out like the camera is. I don't think I can climb with this far away. I can't see him. So Actually, let's go back to the let's do a new game. New game. Let's have it all zoomed out like this. Okay. Here's the full map. There's the snake, so we went over the tree up here. We used to like climbed up all this shit. This is the whole mountain that we climbed up. Let's see, I'm gonna set myself here and see. Uh, oh, you can just go through that. Damn it. Fell in the water. Alright. So that's about it with the game though. Okay, so there looks like there's a balloon holding that up. Blah blah blah. There's all this shit going on. The pliers holding that up. And you know, there's the teeth, the car, there's everything. We climbed it all, folks. Great, huh? Okay, feel proud of yourself that you endured this much. You could have refused, but you didn't. There was something in you that was hidden that chose to continue, as Bennett Foddy says. There's the bucket. I don't know how are you speedrun the bucket that fast, though. I'm literally on the camera zoom out. Maybe it makes it easier for me. And, uh, yeah, here's the thing, yeah. You know, climbing, you get to see, like, everything that you're going up to when you have this far out. Okay, and up the rocks and mountains and everything. And then... We're just gonna climb up the tower on camera zoom out just so you see what... And you can see the rocks. See, it's all the same. It's all the same map every time. Rocks, same place. The rocks don't move, by the way. I don't think that, yeah, yeah. The rocks don't move, by the way. And then, there's actually an Easter egg that I'm going to show you now. Camera distance, 5.0, that's the way. If you could just climb over this, Actually, I think maybe they're like. Anyway, when you start. Oh, wait, he's not gonna do the bad ending thing. You know, let's not actually get the bad ending right here. Let's just climb on up, actually. Here, let's climb on out of this. And if we. Okay, then we fall to the other end. Let's see if we can just reach the Easter egg that I'm going to show you guys. We're going to go down the ice mountain here. And I missed it. It's right there. It's Sexy Hiking. Right there. If you guys have played Sexy Hiking, which I have not played Sexy Hiking before, I just know. I've seen videos of that game. Let's actually use mods to reach this guy. Cause there's a big surprise if we reach him. And we're gonna slide down. We're gonna use a giant hammer mod for this. There we go. Up. Fuck, dude. Shit, 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 shit. Um, okay, yeah, we're trapped. Like, oh, no, 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 we're not. Oh, the hammer's floppy. Alright. So, I'm gonna put a link in the description on how to get the, the mods, by the way. You know what? It might be too hard to reach him. Let's just do the casual way. Alright, listen closely here. 
That's the that's the thing he says when you beat the level in sexy hiking. So yes, folks, we did it. We have beaten the game. Now, let's just go all the way to the top and fall back down to the bottom now. Oh, damn it. Stupid tower. Okay, here we go. Or no, not the tower. Stupid fucking, fucking outer space is doing it. Outer space is fault. Uh, no, 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 uh, 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 did it. Nope. Ladies and gentlemen, that was how to beat Getting Over It. This is my face reveal for this video. And that was how we beat getting over it with Bennett Foddy. I hope this helps. Please leave your comments so I know how you did with you watching this video on how to beat the game and shit. Like, let me let me know if this video helped. Because if this video helped, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to my channel because I've got really good videos. And I also have ga more gaming. So if you want more of this content, content then subscribe. Thank you.